Hello, my Piscians. How are you cutie pies doing? It is Wednesday water sign week and we are doing your reading. I hope you guys are having a great uh, midweek and that's really starts your week. Um, I hope it's been a good week for you guys. I am using Tarot of the Mystical Moments for the main deck, Golden Art Nouveau Tarot for the clarifying deck. The links to these decks can be found down below in the description box along with links to decks I've used in the past. Um, thank you Pisces for watching, liking, subscribing, tuning in. It really, 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 really adds up. It really does it help. It just, I, I really appreciate the crap out of you guys. And if you are new to the channel and feeling the vibe, please feel free to like and subscribe. I would appreciate, I would appreciate that greatly. Okay, Queen of Cups, you are. I will say whenever I do previous reads, like I did Scorpio first and Cancer, usually the sign I'm about to do shows up in the that reading, the reading before. You haven't really showed up today. So I'm wondering, where is Pisces? Where is your energy? Five of Wands and the Queen of Cups. I feel like you guys just tapping into this are very internal. You're really focused maybe on your goals, on your dreams, on where you want to be. Not so much on other people these days. The Five of Wands, I feel like this is you getting your fight back, fighting for what you want, like really ready to conquer something huge. Queen of Cups, I feel like it's a level up. I mean, you're the Knight of Cups. And in Tarot, the Knights are striving to be the king and I feel like you're already the queen. I don't even see like the Knight. Queen of Cups, yeah, Justice, I think you want what is rightfully yours. You don't want to be without anymore. Without love, is it? Without a Ten of Pentacles, without a home, without a job. Whatever it is that you deem happily ever after, you're getting it. You're not putting it off anymore. The Nine of Wands reverse is procrastination. Seven of Cups reverse is getting really clear on where you need to be these days. I really feel that. Um, that is, that's, that may not be the main reading, but yeah, Seven of Cups reverse once again and the Nine of Swords. I think whatever you got out of, if it was a job, something you maybe you had to get out of for your own sanity or somebody let you go and it maybe created this dark soul, like not dark soul, dark, I have a really bad migraine, so bear with me guys, but dark night of the soul, um, I really feel what is coming out is such a strong Piscean that you are making sure you're never going to get sidetracked or allow somebody to do that to you again, affect you like that. And you are really checking off your own boxes these days. You're not looking to get your boxes checked by somebody else. You can do that yourself. And I feel like that's where you are. It's like you're building an empire and you're the emperor. You're going towards emperors, what you're doing. All right, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If you are a Pisces, know a Pisces, feel like being a Pisces. Well, Piscean, I'm glad you're here. You can be a Pisces and this resonates. You can be dealing with a Pisces and it can resonate as the main story. Pisces could be the cross watcher. So what I'm saying is this reading can be for a Pisces. This reading could be about a Pisces. All right, Pisces. Can I say it again? Pisces. How many times did I say it? It's a drinking game and be in trouble. All right, Pisces. I said it again. All right, general energy. What are the collective messages that need to come out for our Pisceans? What are the general energy? What is the general energy for the Pisceans? Collect the messages that need to come out today. There it is. Three of Wands reversed, no longer waiting. Good to have your back to the past. But what I'm getting with this is you're not waiting. You're not waiting to, you're not gonna be put on hold. You're not gonna be ignored and you're not gonna be looked over anymore. Three of Cups and the King of Wands and the Sun. That's why I couldn't find you adorable Knight of Cups because you are the King of Wands these days. You are creating paths where none exists, opportunities where none exists. That's that Three of Wands reverse. You want to be happy and this is the energy you're in. You don't want the past. You don't want the, what the past offered. You don't want even the old version of yourself. You want who you are creating. Like you're creating yourself in the moment. Does that make sense? You're manifesting. It's like somebody who you once imagined yourself to be, you're actually creating that person. What's influencing the three of wands reverse Aries energy? I, I feel so much fire with you. What is the three of wands reverse Aries energy? Three of Wands Reverse, Aries Energy. What is that? Two cards. And there you are, the hangman there. Magician Reverse and the Moon Reverse. Now, there you are, the Moon Reverse, but it is the Sun Upright, but it's 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 even better than the Sun Upright um, because this comes with Ascension. 
This comes with the blessings after the lesson. And what you're realizing, the magician reverse, is you're the only one that can create the life that you you see possible. Maybe some of you thought you could marry and have that and somebody complete you like that. You didn't have to do the work, you know. This sounds really negative. I don't <laughs> I'm not trying to say gold digger, but you know, it's kind of like the easy way. There's no easy way in getting what you really, really want. It has to come from within. So the magician reverse is no longer putting off yourself on hold anymore, waiting for somebody else to see the bet the your worth and and taking you up and giving you that raise or giving you you know no you realize that people are very self-focused and they're worried about themselves and you not worrying about yourself and worrying about others really didn't work out so well for you so i feel like with the moon reverse is actually the enlightening the the magic that's really ready to be revealed has always been within you the magician reverse it's just been waiting for you to tap into it see the typical magician card is he's pointing with a hand a finger up in the sky and he's pointing one to the ground and um it's about drilling and grounding ideas into reality. So, I mean, I know why they're doing it, but what always bothers me is he's got all the new beginnings on his table. He's got the Ace of Pentacles, the Ace of Swords, the Ace of Wands, the Ace of Cups, and yet he's still thinking about what he's gonna do with them. I don't think you're thinking anymore. You're now, three of ones reverse, you're doing. You're not gonna lose any more time. You want, you want it all, Pisces, and nothing's stopping you from getting it. You spent enough time thinking about this. Now you're you're on fire. That's what I feel. This girl and boy is on fire. All right, what's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading for the Pisceans? What's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading? What's that's a lot, but I feel like yeah, justice. Maybe a a new contract, a new you, a new day, a new way. Um, justice is is a new karmic um, connection, soulmate com coming in, but I feel like graduation gift, you know, like all the lessons you went through, you already graduated and this is universe gift to you. This, this, what's below it, nine of wands reverse, 10 of pentacles, yeah, there it is, king of pentacles reverse, whoever, and this could even been you lacking confidence, not really working, not really living up to your best life. This really could be your energy, um, not not living the best version of you. And this is the old Pisces. What's the new Pisces? Because coming in strong with the Tower is you want it all with the Ten of Pentacles. You want something that that nobody can ever take away again because you're creating this. This is legacy right here. This is this is a lot of security. And that's exactly what a King of Pentacles has. But I feel like you've gone without for so long. Maybe you, you've come from very humble beginnings and you, you just thought your life was, even though you had dreams and aspirations, you really thought your life was gonna go only one way. And something opened your eyes recently to say, you know what, why am I settling for this? Why am I settling for a job that barely pays my bills and doing without? I just feel like you're going for it all right now and nothing's stopping you from getting it. You're really grounded in reality. And I, Seven of Pentacles, yeah, look at this, Six of Wands and Seven of Pentacles reverse. I just don't think you're wasting any time. Seven of Pentacles reverse, some of you, the best thing that happened was you lost that job or you didn't get that promotion or that relationship didn't work out because it really put you on a different path where the, the old job or old relationship would have changed you and kept you stuck in something that overall wouldn't have made you very happy. Okay, what's the reason for the reading for the Pisceans? What's the reason for the reading for the Pisceans? What's the reason for the reading for the Pisceans? What's the reason for the reading? The Ten of Pentacles reverse. You got let go of something. You could have got fired, could have lost your job, money problems, debt, bankruptcy, home. It just kept coming, didn't it? It just kept coming and coming and coming until there was nothing left for the, the, the devil to take. And so in that dark night of soul, you realize now what? And I feel like that's where you really tapped into your superpowers. The magician reverse and the moon reverse is where you really tapped into who you are. And yeah, three of wands reverse is, I feel like it's this huge momentum of 
saying, I've put my life on hold for somebody to claim me or somebody to see my worth or somebody to help me up and they didn't. And realizing that all this time you were the one who was supposed to be the hero of your own story, the happily ever after, it begins and ends with you. I'm not saying you're gonna do this alone and never have love, but you're realizing maybe if you were a Piscean who didn't really have the happy connections, maybe it's because you were supposed to have it completed first, if that makes sense. Um, if you have never been married or never had that, maybe it's because life is trying to get you in a different area of the world or a different area of the of the country whatever it is different area of the city a different job because if you got rooted in whatever you thought you were going to have the real gift that justice card the real gift wasn't there it's over here and so in this dark night of the soul you're realizing i don't want to be here anymore i want to be there and that's really where life begins Okay, what is in the past for the Pisceans? What is in the past for the Pisceans? What is in the past for the Pisceans? What is in the past? And the Four of Cups, overlooked, overshadowed. Pisces, something tells me you're not gonna be overlooked here very long. And the people who look down on you are gonna have to be looking up to you because you are really, you will not be ignored. It's like, I just feel like you were overlooked and put down and not taken seriously. And yeah, I mean, that I know there was another sign that kind of had that energy of it. I just, I think you're gonna about to prove a lot of people wrong here. Okay, what is on Piscean's mind? What is on the Piscean's mind? Ooh, that is a lot. Oh no, just justice and nine of pentacles reverse. What did I say? Whatever didn't work out, 10 of pentacles reverse, nine of pentacles reverse, that relationship that I'd stopped giving, uh, stopped trying, it, it, it wasn't going anywhere. It's because you were meant to be somewhere else. In this uncomfortability, uncomfortability is where change happens. Change doesn't happen when we're happy. Change doesn't happen when we're comfortable. It happens when we're uncomfortable. Life is making you very uncomfortable to try to turn you into the piece of gold that you are. The, the gold necklace that you, that you wear, the ring that you wear was once a rock. It was something underground. It was something unseen. It was in the dirt. People, you know, it was covered in dirt. And then somebody come and found it and then said, hey, this would be, this is really beautiful, but let me torture it for a while. I feel like that's what God has been doing with these life lessons with you, has been torturing your soul and turning you in and shaping you and heating you up. And every time you got comfortable, something else changed. It's to manipulate your energy to turn you into the shining piece of jewelry to be seen and not be ignored. And people will be like, oh my gosh, where'd you find that piece? And it's unique, it's uniquely you you are uniquely you you're just becoming it so if you're uncomfortable you should be realizing you're actually in god's favor not disfavor but in god's favor because there is a big plan for you Whew. what is the near future for the pisceans what is in the near future for the pisceans what is the near future for the pisceans here near future what is the near future for the pisceans two of wands a decision to be made getting you out of your comfort zone. In there was comfortable, but I don't think you were happy. Got on your roof, you're getting more comfortable with being uncomfortable, but a, a decision, still looking up to your moon sign, looking for intuition, looking for guidance, looking for confirmation. But I do feel a decision is about to be made. All right, what is this three of wands reverse? That's funny, you got a two and three. Where's our four of wands coming in? But three of wands reverse, influenced by the magician reverse and the moon reverse. Influenced by two major arcanas. Major arcanas are things out of our control. But I have a feeling that you were trying to control the uncontrollable. You were in something that wasn't really happy, but you thought if, if they would just pick me or if it would, it was like almost like, I don't want to say the easy way out because Maybe you don't wanna to have to change a job or change a relationship or go back to the drawing board, but it was back to, but this is this just wasn't for you. I, I don't know how else to say that. It just, it would have really limited your abilities and happiness and made you, yeah, four cups. I just feel like 
that that would have been peak happiness in that situation as a four of cups and you want the ten of cups you want your energy okay what is this three of wands reverse influenced by the magician reverse and the moon reverse three of wands reverse no longer waiting that ship that opportunity is coming in what is the three of wands reverse and the ace of wands reverse what is this another card and the two of swords that's waiting two of swords and the ace of wands is it tells me that something let you go or you let something go and you've been healing you've been in this two of swords moment in the card of finding your center your peace of ready for a big pivot you probably in a, a bit of a hangman energy but the thing is is i feel like you know in this healing process you don't realize how far you come until you're on the other side and i feel like you're about to be on the other side with the moon reverse it's like you're in between the moon the sun and the magician reverse like you're you're ready once that magician card is upright it's go time like the energy is going to really pick up so take this opportunity as a breather to collect yourself collect your energy because you're about going to need all of your energy here soon what is the ten of pentacles reverse reason for the reading king of wands i think that's where you guys are at creating a business putting yourself out there for a new job i feel like this is really heavily work related putting yourself out there for a new job realizing that you know what i'm not settling for being like this in my bank account of, of having to you know pay one bill and not pay three whatever it is you're you're not even getting your needs met at this point forget your wants I mean, a vacation is laughable. You are just trying to get your needs met in what you're currently doing. And you're, that's what taps into this, this resourcefulness within you. This is where you might start a business. This is where you go and sell yourself in, a, in such a high marketable way in a position you never thought you would have and you actually get it. Um, this is when you have nothing left to lose, you're dangerous because there's nothing to go back to. So you really put yourself out there. And the thing is, is it's confidence that you need. That's all. You need the confidence because if you have the confidence and you're selling yourself like this, people will believe it. They will really believe it. Okay, what is the four of cups in the past, Pisces? What's the four of cups? Queen, queen of cups energy, yes, but cancerian energy. The four of cups in the past, overlooked and overshadowed and stressed, overly stressed and underpaid. Nine of swords. Why the nine of swords and four of cups? And I feel like that's where the moon was. Four of Cups and the Nine of Swords and the Ace of Cups. If this job would just see, give me that chance or this relationship, I feel like it, it's just like you wanted to win. It was like it, it would have validated your existence or something. Um, Ace of Cups and you just it just really tells me you really wanted it. Ace of Cups, you really wanted it. And they it just they overlooked you. Okay, what is this justice in the Knight of Pentacles reverse? Five of Swords reverse. Justice in the Knight of Pentacles reverse. What is that? What is the justice? That's where it's at on your mind. Justice. Justice. Balancing the karmic scales here. What is the justice? Because I feel like you've always been getting the short end of the stick. I'm speechless, actually. I'm speechless. I didn't expect that card and upright on your mind you know it's always been within you it's always been within you you just haven't looked down just like what did i say he points to the sky see your hangman tree there you're hanging from this tree still trying to get this perspective you but it, you've always had the abilities i really feel see the magician is a very very strong manifester it's alchemy right it's it's somebody who can turn take a piece of gold and make it a beautiful piece of jewelry um it all depends on your perspective and it's just funny because i never noticed i have never noticed the tree branch before and the past behind him um i never noticed the tree branch but i feel like that's your hangman energy there trying to grill out these ideas but i feel like you've been putting your resources on hold i feel like life because we had a magician reverse right here i think life tipped you upside down so you finally are forced to look at who you are and what you have to work with i'm telling you pisces is confidence 
I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, the confidence is how you carry yourself. That is the perspective. It's not somebody coming in to validate you to say, hey, where have you been my whole life? Or why take this job, Jesus, what are you doing in the mail room? You should be running the company. It's the confidence of selling yourself how you should be selling yourself. Not like that, dirty birds, not like that, but some of you, it might be like that. You might be needing to pick a different corner, I don't know. But no, the magician and the justice is about saying, you know what? I got, I got ideas. I got some ideas for this place. I, it's going in with this air of confidence, not arrogance, but confidence, because that makes people want to bet on you. They don't really know what you're up to, but they know it could be profitable. I'm getting very work related here. Your 10 of pentacles has always been within these cups on your table. Some of you've been looking at other people's tables and other people's dreams and other people's cupboards and realizing it was just not, it wasn't really meant for you. And the life that you've been in, really, maybe you felt like it really wasn't meant for you either. Nothing wrong with the people around it, but you were just meant for something more. You are meant for extraordinary, trying to live an ordinary life. And now you're waking up to the extraordinary and it's uncomfortable because you realize, holy shit, I'm supposed to be amazing because I am amazing, but I'm still stuck in this ordinary life. Now what do I do? It's there's your pivot. And if you're there, good news is you're ready to get on your chariot. You're ready to get up on those nights. Um, you're, tapping it, you're tapping into the deepest part of yourselves. Okay, 201's in the near future. I'm using all my energy on your reading. I actually feel so nauseous with this reading at this point. I gotta go put an ice pack on my head. I'm using every bit of energy I've left for you guys and then I'm done. Near future, the fool. You have an exciting new beginning, Pisces, exciting new beginning. One day you're going to realize that the thing you wanted most would have only held you back. It was this, you were a cute, adorable fish in a very small fishbowl. If that, if you would have stayed there, God has something much, much bigger for you. And you're going to look back and run into this person or job and say, Hey, you know what? You know, I don't have this hard feelings because you're going to get that perspective. Say this, this would have held me back. It just simply would have held you back. And that is, it's really, you're at the beginning of the rest of your life. I mean, really an exciting life. Once you get that perspective of saying, it's always been within my mind. The magician is the alchemy of thoughts. It's the manifester. It's, it's, it's how you use your thoughts as, as magic spells. You, if you want to put your thoughts in what you can have, you're going to have a lot of shit you don't want. If you want to put your thoughts in everything you do want, there's nothing that's going to stop you from getting it. So really be careful where you're putting your thoughts. When you have two magicians out here, you, you're, you would be surprised. I mean, we live in, in today's world. If this was 500 years ago, People believed in witches and wizards and magic. I mean, it, it wasn't hard to sell that. People would be like, oh, and they took it seriously. We are trained at very early on that that doesn't exist, but the reality is it still exists. It always existed, but it's not in a cauldron. It's not in herbs and things in the woods and, and chants. It's within our minds. It, we're energy, we're en beings of energy. And so we can manipulate our own energy and how we want it. That's why you have mothers having superhuman strength to lift a car off a child in the time of need. Where did they get it? Well, what are we only using? 6% of our brain? What's going on with the other 94%? Um, that's what you're tapping into. You're realizing with two magician powers here is saying, oh, I mean, it might even make you even scared at a, at a not scared, but when you realize all this time that you were the only thing holding your back, yourself back and you're the only thing pushing yourself forward, you're gonna kind of have a momentary of why didn't I understand this many years ago? It doesn't matter, who knows, but you understand it now and that's all that matters. So I don't even know why I went down that path. <laughs> <laughs> I'm telling you, it's a migraine. I'm, I'm feeling my way through this. But yeah, Pisces, it's a really, really great reading. I, that It's the perspective of whatever you got out of really did you a favor. They did you a big ass favor because you, again, would have been a more of a four cups here, even if you got it. So good luck, Pisces. Um, have a great rest of your week and yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Take care.